Pirates and Reapers of the Seas 22. Connect using an Ethernet cable. If I could offer you only one tip for the future, a stable connection to your router would be it. The long-term benefits of lower lag and ping have been proved by scientists, whereas the rest of my advice has no basis more reliable than my own meandering experience. I will dispense this advice now. Enjoy the beauty of the game and freedom it provides. Oh, never mind. You will not understand the freedom that the game gave until the servers have faded. But trust me, in 20 years you'll look back at your Twitter feed and recall in a way you can't grasp now how much friendship and possibility lay before you. The servers are not as toxic as you imagine. Don't worry about the future of the game or worry. But know that worrying is as effective as trying to solve a riddle by sitting on the wrong island, eating a splash tail. The real troubles in your life are apt to be things that never crossed your worried mind. The kind that blindside you halfway through a fort of fortune. Do one thing every day that scares you. Play a shanty. Don't be reckless when leaving your ship unattended for too long. Don't put up with people who are reckless with theirs. Jolly jiggle. Don't waste your time on jealousy. Sometimes you're ahead. Sometimes you're behind. The race to legend is long, and in the end, it's only a hideout and cosmetics. Remember the compliments you receive. Forget the insults. If you succeed in doing this, tell me how. Keep your old cosmetics. Throw away your old voyages. Sword Dash. Don't feel guilty if you don't know what voyages you want to do that session. The most interesting pirates I know don't know at Athena 40 what they want to do with their session. Some of the most interesting reapers I know still don't. Eat plenty of bananas. Be careful with your chain shots. You'll miss them when they're gone. Maybe you'll parry, maybe you won't, maybe you'll get sunk, maybe you won't, maybe you'll quit as a reaper level 40, maybe you'll dance the shovel dance when you hit hunter's call 50, whatever you do, don't congratulate yourself too much or berate yourself either, your choices are half chance, so are everyone else's. Enjoy your pirate's poses and emotes, use them every way you can. Don't be afraid of it, or what other people think of it. It's the greatest source of screenshots you'll ever own. Dance! Even if you have nowhere to do it but in your captain's cabin. Read the directions in the tall tale, even if you don't follow them. Do not dress in the legendary purple, it will only make you feel ugly. Get to know your crewmates. You will never know when they'll be gone for good. Be nice to your opponents. They are the best link to your past and the people most likely to teach you how to get better at PvP. Understand that Xbox friends come and go, but for the precious few you should hold on. Work hard to bridge the gaps in geography and lifestyle, because the older you get, the more you need the people you knew when you were just starting out. Sail in the devil's roar once, but leave before it makes you hard. Live in the shores of gold once, but leave before it turned you into a living skeleton made of gold. Sail. Accept certain inalienable truths. Prizes for cosmetics will rise. Captains will go AFK. You too will get bored. Then when you do, you will fantasize that when you were a fresh pirate, prices were reasonable. Captains were noble, and the new pirate respected their elders. Respect your elders. Don't expect anyone else to support you. Maybe you have a full cone force. Maybe you have a wealthy crewmate. But you never know when either one may run out. Don't mess too much with your hair, or by the end of the session you'll forget which combination you normally use for your pirate. Be careful whose advice you buy on the Discord. Be patient with those who supply it on the forum. Advice is a form of nostalgia. Dispensing it is the way of fishing the past from a shipwreck. Placing it carefully on the bowsprit, sailing to an outpost and selling it for more than it's worth. But trust me on the ethernet, 